Biology at Pima Community College. In this video, we're going to demonstrate use and care of the microscope that we would find in our classes. To start out, once you locate your microscope and plug it in, be sure to turn on your light source located on the side of the scope. First, place your glass slide on the stage. Use the clip to keep it in position. You're going to rotate the ocular lens and adjust to your particular eye width. Use the coarse adjustment knob or the large knob on the side of the scope to raise the stage. Once you begin to see color, usually either pink or purple in our class, you're ready to move up to the next objective. Use the nose piece to place 10x in position. Since this is a parfocal microscope, there's minimal adjustments that we need to do with the coarse adjustment knob, but adjust as necessary. Once you see color, use the nose piece and move up to 40x. Here's where you can begin to work with the fine focus knob or the small knob located on the side of the microscope. Adjust in one direction, ideally until coloration becomes clear. Once you think you see cells, you're ready to move to oil. For this part, move the 140x out of the way. You're now going to place a single drop of oil right over the glass line, typically where you see the light shining through. Then place 100x into position. Take note, for order, in order for this to work, you really need to make sure that your objective makes physical contact with the oil. Ideally, you should be able to use your fine focus until cells become clear. You may need to adjust your light source. You may need to adjust your IOS diaphragm, which you can read about later in the lab manual. Once you see cells, call over your instructor. You're ready to show off what you found. If you're stuck and you're not able to identify any bacteria at 100x, you cannot simply go back down to 40. It's really important that you only get oil on the 100x objective. However, you are welcome to go back down to 10x or 4x and scan through your slide again. Other common problems that happen here, again, adjust your light source. In some cases, students flip over the glass slide and they're looking at the bottom of the slide and they're not looking at the top of the cells. That's a quick check that you can look for by using your wax pencil, by scraping it gently with your finger. It is possible that you use too much decolorizer in your staining process. You've perhaps washed away your cells. If stuck, don't hesitate to reach out to a partner or your instructor who can come over and help you. When you're uh, finished viewing your microorganisms under the microscope, use the nose piece and get the 100x out of position. Next, lower the stage to its lowest position. You're going to use a fresh piece of lens paper from your kit. And you're going to use a fresh piece in order to wipe off the oil from the 100x objective. Gently blot until no more excess oil comes off on the lens paper. If you did accidentally get oil on the 40X or any other objective, please notify your instructor. Next, remove the glass slide from the stage. Be sure to dispose of it in the proper waste before you leave. 
check the stage and the rest of the microscope for any other oil. Anything that looks greasy, you're going to want to wipe off with a fresh piece of lunch paper. Set your ocular lens in place. And you can wipe off the ocular lens when finished. Tighten it, your position in place. Make sure your light source is off, unplug, and put away in the appropriate cabinet. 